Guys, the chickens here, bringing you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we're going to be going over the best tips and tricks, beginner starting uh, strats, and everything like that for Season 3 of Warships, what we've learned so far. So uh, let's go ahead and dive on into it. All right, so first let's go over uh, let's go over the tech tree first. Most important thing, most important things to upgrade in the chicken's opinion, and I'm not sure exactly what the order would be, but uh, landing crafts, heavies, cannons, barrage, and then everything else kind of falls into whatever you want to use. Uh, gunboat energy is is I, I would say probably fifth. Uh, then you know. Upgrade your defenses so there's more of them. Upgrade your mines so you get more of them. It doesn't really matter. Always select cannons on the multi-nodes. Uh, because basically what the meta has turned into so far is just all heavies. Basically what happens is um, we don't have any flares, right? We don't. Nobody unlocks flares until uh, we get to 500 tech level, which takes a while to get to. So nobody has flares. So everyone's making these kind of trap bases like this. Now, I will say that there is a way that people can throw out troops on this side over here. Uh, so make sure that you throw your engine rooms up on the other side. Um, and everything like that. So, <clears throat> the the other biggest thing is, uh, yeah, because people are using all heavies. They don't have flares. So, basically, people are making these trap bases. But the biggest mistake that I've seen people make so far is they put their engine rooms up here like this. Don't do that. Don't do that. Because uh, they they look at the, the they have twenty thousand health, and a barrage at level three does um, over ten thousand damage. That doesn't add up. Um, either way, the barrage does a lot of damage to the engine rooms. So uh, right now, uh, two of my barrage would take out one of my engine rooms. So it doesn't take long to barrage them down. So make sure they're spaced out a little bit. That being said, don't put them way over here. Because what you can do is, what I've been having success with, I'll actually just show you this on a replay, uh, my replay, we lost the battle, but whatever. Um, basically what I was able to do, since I didn't have flares, it's all about what they're going to target first, right? So I used my barrage on all those defenses that were just basically designed to make my troops walk up this left side. Um, I took those down, and then I placed my troops down, and they just went straight for both engine rooms. Now, we still ended up losing because I, I took a very long time to, like, individually barrage all those defenses, which was kind of dumb. So, you're going to do that. Make sure you do it fast. So you don't waste time. Um, but, yeah, don't do that. Don't put them over here. Put them over here. You know, if they can get clipped with the same barrage, that's fine. It's still going to take a lot of GBE. He's still going to have to walk through most of your base to uh, barrage them down. Um, so, the reason I'm using two heavies is because I just don't have them upgraded just yet. I only have them upgraded to level three, so they're not super... Um, I upgraded my rifleman. I made a bit of a mistake uh, doing that, so don't do that. Just stick with the heavies, and you're going to be fine. And then once you get past the second and the third engine room, um, you know that's when the game opens up a little bit more, and you have more kind of variance in uh, the different things you can pick. Okay, so um, yeah, it's always good to barrage down stuff. So we got his first engine room down with no issues, really. And next, let's go like this. So I don't want them to target that sniper tower or that cannon. I want them to just go uh, straight for that engine. And I want them all to focus on that. So basically, that's what you're that's how you're kind of going through your attack. Because we only have barrage. We don't have any other gunboat abilities, which is kind of crazy. Um, but, you know, it's warships, man. It's warships. It's crazy. It's weird. It's different. It's a whole new style. Every month, it's a whole new way to play the game. And I kind of love it. Um, yeah, I kind of love it. So, Panda Tour. Yeah, here's the issue with using low-level heavies. I forget if we can if we can see what the, the the level of them is on the on the replay, but uh, I feel like it's probably not that high. Okay, so we got another victory there. Uh, I should be at rank 14 by now. I would think we just won. I right, we just won one bro. Um, okay, so let's 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 uh, let's win another one here. Let's do that. I think we can do it, guys. Uh, okay, so this is basically our base. Um, mm -hmm. I think what we're gonna have to do here is we're gonna have to take down a lot of this stuff. 
we're basically going to take down that sniper tower, that mortar, and hopefully, hopefully they're going to go up off over to the right. I think we'll actually have enough here to take down uh, this machine gun. I don't know if it's going to be long enough to for them to switch the target. Uh, okay, we got a couple of them to move. We got a couple of them to move. They're going to walk straight into those mines, though. That's where heavies would help, obviously. But we will get one doing this. Man, this guy's base was actually pretty pretty decent. They still went down that way. That's crazy. Okay, so we're going to hit another mine. I think we have enough rifle in there to take it down. Uh, this is going to be very close. I like how it tells you that the opponent is attacking and they're not scouting or anything. So you know exactly what's going on. This could go either way. I forget if we attacked. I think we attacked pretty quickly, so I feel like we're going to lose. Um, oh my god, we lost by one second. We lost by one second. Ah, craziness, craziness. Um, okay, so let's try another one here. And yes, I'm going to upgrade heavies. We're going to eventually use all heavies, so don't worry about that. Uh, okay, so we're going to go like... We're going to throw them all out here. And I think I'm just going to barrage down that engine room over there. And it's also kind of nice bringing the heavies because then, you know, you're not getting torched with machine guns or um, the cannons don't really do that much. Uh, they're not really that big of an issue for riflemen. Um, those mines will be though, so, you know, there's pros and cons to everything. Same as anything in life, guys. There's always pros and cons to everything, every decision. Okay, we're going to go engine rooms here. Uh... Okay, now we're just waiting for them to walk. That's it. Well, welcome, welcome to season three of Warships, guys. We're waiting for the troops to walk. That's what it's about. That's what it's about. It's, it's like I said, it's fun though. It's cool. It's different. It's, it's different. So I'm, I'm not too. Uh, I like it. I like it. You know, as long as it's fair for everybody, that's all I care about. And as long as people put their engine rooms on the far side, that stupid landing thing, it's not game breaking. It's not a big deal. It's really not sure you'll get caught caught off guard with it before you know what it is but then you know what it is so it's not a big deal okay he's got uh, some heavies going in there and i think we're gonna come away with the hashtag chick tree on that one guys easy stuff so far so yeah we're just gonna keep uh i think that's basically all i have for uh tips general uh pushing strategy ad ad advice for the the first couple stages why did we not hit rank 14 we just went up um or we just lost another one again i don't know what's going on let's do one more let's do one more i want to hit rank 14. <laughs> we, we we're getting so close here we keep losing one and then and then winning one uh i don't know what to do here He's got his defenses pretty well mapped out. Okay, let's go one, two, and like that. And I'm gonna go one, two. And hopefully, hopefully we can pull them over to that right side before they go this way. How did he already get an engine room down? Oh man. If we got that cannon down, I think we would have been fine. I think they all would have went up towards the right. But now, hardly any of them are going to. They're all going to that cannon. Um, jeez, man. Okay, I'm going to take on the machine gun because it's far away. Actually, I didn't need to do that at all. I should have taken down the other one. Oh, man. Yeah, we're getting smoked here. We're getting smoked. Season 3 of Warships, guys. It's interesting. It's different. Uh, let me know how you're making out down below in that comment section. And uh, any tips, tricks, advice, uh, general strategy, whatever your best tips are, uh, throw them down there. And I'll try to pin the best ones to help out everybody. Um, and yeah, that's basically all I got on uh, Season 3 of Warships. I'm having a lot of fun with it. It's goofy. I know. But it's, uh, it's fun. It's different, like we said already. So uh, yeah, I'm just going to leave it at that. And, uh, yeah, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. We're going to be bringing you everything that is Warships and uh, Mega Crab later tonight. We're going to be streaming. Uh, so make sure to stay tuned for that. And, as always, uh, make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll see you next one, guys. Chicken out.